Hello everyone, in this lecture we will study commerce on stage with trial mode. So for triode load, a MOS device operating in the deep triode region, that is the deep active region, behave as a register and can therefore serve as a load in a common source stage. Okay, for a deep triode region, we have already studied when we were studying for the common source stage with resistive load. For a deep triode region, the VSD should be lesser than lesser than twice of VSD minus mod of VTH. So it will behave like a resistor and for this case the R on 2 will become as 1 upon mu T Qx W by L VSG minus mod of VTH. And this VSG in this case, this VSG. So we have applied a voltage at the gate terminal of M2. Okay. VB. So this VSG will be equal to VGD minus VB. So 1 upon mu P COX W by L VGD minus VB minus VTS. So this VB should be low enough to make sure that M2 is in deep triode region. But it requires an additional complexity to be precisely generated. And in this case, the voltage gain will become as minus of GM1 into R on the resistance C from the this terminal of M2 that is R2 in parallel with R01. The voltage gain can be readily cal calculated okay, by using this formula and the principal drawback of this circuit stems from the dependence of this R2 upon mu T, COX and VTH okay, which in turn depend upon the technology being used while fabricating the device. But it requires less voltage then diode connected devices okay as the m1 which is to be in saturation mode requires that v out should be written as vgs1 minus vts this is the vds voltage so vds should be greater than vgs1 minus vts which is equals to be effective and for m2 this m2 is acting like a resistor and this for this it is equals to v out is equals to vgd this is what is equals to this Okay, so this particular amplifier with dry load is very difficult uh, to design and use. Okay, so among the five variants we have studied till now, those employing basic current source are find find wider usage than the triode load. Okay, thank you. <laughs>